is Ashbourne, a peaceful town, a gentle town of soft grey stone. But twice a year, the town is boarded up. Twice a year, Ashbourne lays siege to its tranquility. The cause of this fearful activity is Ashbourne football, a traditional game that 70-year-old Percy Chadwick played when he was younger. When he stopped playing, he started making the ball and has done so for the past 16 years. Made from shoe leather and filled with cork dust, the ball is finally painted. Such protection is needed because the rules of Ashbourne football aren't exactly clear. Its only resemblance to conventional football is that it's played by two sides. But what sides? Before the game, the ball is walked round the town, and that's the last time most people see it. The sides are known as the uppards and the downards, depending on whether the participants in this mass murder come from above or below the brook that runs through the centre of the town. The point of the game, incredibly, is to score goals, but as the goals are situated three miles apart, high scores are not to be expected. Invariably, vast sections of the players lose track of the ball. It's not under the bridge, chaps. It's up in the high street. Add a bit of traffic, too, and the game gets really exciting. Exciting? It's a revolution. 